Hello everyone, and welcome to my bold and beautiful 24 channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. RJ is stunned by the truth about Luna. The bold and the beautiful BNB spoilers for Monday, April 15th, 2024, depict a stressful day in fictitious Los Angeles as Luna drops a puzzling bomb and Steffi takes over. The bold and the beautiful spoilers. Luna Nozawa tells all. Luna Nozawa, Lisa Yamada, and the powers that be at BNB still don't grasp that she had non-consensual sex with Zen Forrester, Delon de Metz, while high on her mother's mints, which we think were G-edibles. Luna believes she cheated on RJ Forrester, Josh Hoffman, which puts her in the wrong. BNB spoilers Monday, April 15th. RJ is stunned by the truth from Luna. She finally tells RJ what happened and he goes crazy. How can this be? He believed he knew Luna. Heck, he thought he knew his cousin Zend, and now both have betrayed him. Luna is still filled with remorse over something that was not her fault, while Zend is still living in an other world where he might one day have a future with Luna, telling Carter Walton, Lawrence sang Victor, the same thing. He didn't want Luna to tell RJ the truth and cause a schism within his family. BMB spoilers. Steffi Forrester has words with Deacon. Just when Steffi Forrester Finnegan, Jacqueline McInnes would, believe she has finally gotten rid of Sheila Carter, Kimberlyn Brown, and that it was her fault John Finn Finnegan, Tanner Novlin, arrives with a surprise. Also read the bold and the beautiful spoilers. Is Liam Spencer leaving LA? Deacon Sharp, Sean Cannon, is certain that Sheila is still alive because the woman who was reduced to ashes had all ten toes, but Sheila had just nine. After all, she cut one off when she pretended to be mauled by a bear. Steffi needs this nonsense to stop right once, so she goes to Ayal Giordano to speak with Deacon and set him straight. She stabbed the knife into Sheila's chest personally and witnessed her death on the living room floor. Then she went on with her life, breaking up a couple in love simply for the sake of it. She needs Deacon to get this Sheila is alive, thought out of his head and quit attempting to persuade her husband of things that are false. Steffi is caught off guard. Ridge is in denial, and Zen confides in Carter. The bold and the beautiful according to spoilers for Friday, April 12th, Steffi Forrester, Jacqueline McInnes Wood, will be surprised to learn that Deacon Sharp, Sean Cannon, believes Sheila Carter, Kimberlyn Brown, is still alive. Rich Forrester, Torsten K., refuses to accept that Sheila could have survived, despite having done so many times before. Zen de Forrester, Dilly de Metz, confides in Carter Walton, Lawrence Victor. Steffi Forrester can't believe her ears. According to the bold and the beautiful spoilers, Finn informs Steffi that Deacon is losing his mind. After all, they all saw Sheila's body and knew she was dead. Despite visiting Sheila before her memorial, we're holding a service to say farewell to Sheila, even going so far as to press the button and see her get incinerated. Still, Deacon swears the body had ten toes and could not be Sheila. Steffi may be dubious as well, but she could consider the other side of the situation. Sheila has been presumed dead countless times and survived. Could Steffi accept that Deacon may be correct? After all, Steffi's life might be easier without Sheila, but it would be much better if she hadn't killed her. B&B spoilers. Rich Forrester is in denial. Ridge is unconvinced by Deacon's claims that Sheila is still alive. Rich believes that after being with Sheila for so long, Deacon may have gone mad. Steffi could hardly have been unaware that Sheila was at her home. How could Deacon believe this was true? The bold and the beautiful spoilers. Steffi is surprised, Ridge is in denial, and Zend confides in Carter. Deacon will continue to assert that he observed ten toes on the body that was cremated. Ridge will do everything he can to persuade Deacon to change his mind, but it's unlikely. Deacon is so stirred up and ready to find Sheila that he may learn the truth after all. The bold and the beautiful spoilers. Zend Forrester seeks Carter Walton's advice. Zend will seek Carter's assistance, though one wonders why. After all, Carter doesn't have a particularly stellar track record with women. Zend has stated that he needs help figuring out Luna Nozawa, Lisa Yamada, who he knows wants to be with RJ Forrester, Joshua Hoffman. Why does Zend keep pushing the topic when Luna isn't interested in him? Zen does not appear to admit to himself that Luna has a lover. Zen does not take RJ's feelings into account in this situation. Will Carter suggest Zen give up and move on? Does Carter think Zen has a shot to win Luna after all? 
As RJ goes ballistic, Steffi is ready to stop Deacon's madness. Poor Deacon, when he threw what he thought was Sheila's body into the cremation flames, realized she had ten toes as the cloth covering her slipped. Ten toes. He informed Finn about his feelings that Sheila might still be alive, but everyone assumed it was his sadness talking. Finn eventually began to question whether Deacon actually saw what he saw, much to Steffi's surprise. Deacon's unwavering pursuit for answers led him to messages between Sheila and her equally insane look-alike Sugar. Lauren comes up to Deacon and cries, I never want to hear her name again. Meanwhile, Finn tells Steffi, Deacon's in a bad place. Steffi responds, he needs to stop this. With what he's learned about Sugar, would people start to trust Deacon's hypothesis that Sheila is alive somewhere? With Thomas in Paris, RJ wanted himself, Luna, and Zen to step in and assist Hope with her fashion line. Hope agreed and wished Luna and Zen to collaborate closely together. Luna finally broke down last week and began telling RJ about the events of his grandfather's celebration, including how her mother's unique mints played a role. RJ approaches Luna and shouts, My cousin! You too? Luna Krius, I'm sorry. RJ, please. She reaches for RJ, but he pulls away. Things quickly escalate as RJ confronts his cousin. Zend yells at RJ. Blame me, don't blame her. RJ hits him and says, I do blame you. Will RJ and Luna get through this? Steffi's insanity. Are Sheila's sightings just her imagination? According to spoilers from the bold and the beautiful John Finn Finnegan, Tanner Novlin, does not believe Sheila Carter, Kimberlyn Brown, is still alive. However, Steffi Forrester Finnegan's, Jacqueline McInnes would. Unresolved concerns may lead her to see Sheila. Of course, Finn would believe Steffi, but what if it wasn't entirely true? Could Steffi's seeing of Sheila be due to her imagination or trauma? The bold and the beautiful spoilers. Steffi Forrester John Finnegan's mental state. According to BNB spoilers, Steffi has been in quite the mental state since the double shooting. Even though Finn and Steffi recovered from Sheila's near-fatal attack, there was still trauma. Then when Sheila reappeared and began working at Ayel Giardino restaurant, Steffi fell even worse. With Sheila's death, Steffi believes her difficulties are ended. The bold and the beautiful spoilers. Are Steffi's insane outbursts and Sheila's sightings just her imagination? However, Steffi appears to be going overboard with Hope Logan, Annika Noel. Steffi even intimated that Brooke Logan, Catherine Kelly Lang, would be next. B&B spoilers. Deacon Sharp's theory. Fans were merely watching as Deacon thought. He spotted Sheila's body with ten toes in the crematory. For this reason, Deacon feels Sheila is still alive. Deacon presented his notion to Finn, who labeled him insane. Then Finn revealed Deacon's theory about Sheila to Steffi. Even if Steffi doesn't voice it, she may become apprehensive that Deacon is onto something. The Bold and the Beautiful Spoilers Sheila Carter Sightings According to the Bold and the Beautiful Teasers, Steffi may become focused on the thought that Sheila is still alive. Steffi could hear noises and saw shadows again. Steffi might actually see Sheila. Of course, Finn would immediately believe Steffi. But what if Steffi isn't seeing exactly what she thinks? BNB spoilers. Insanity and imagination. Steffi may see Sheila coming to attack her again. Of course, Steffi's reaction would be to kill Sheila again in order to protect her family. What if that person isn't Sheila? Imagine the tragedy if Steffi accidentally killed Finn or Liam Spencer, Scott Clifton. Nobody knows if Sheila is dead or alive, so anything could happen. Fans have been yearning for Sheila to have a redemption storyline. While some admirers have come to appreciate and adore Sheila, the Forster family is a different story. Something must happen to sway people's opinions in favor of Sheila. Could Steffi's fantasy and lunacy be the key to Sheila's real fresh start?